Hey YouTube, uh, it's me again. Uh, first of all, I've got to apologise for those who care. Um, I didn't manage to get a video on um, of the after the last modifications on the last video. Uh, but, um, well, I've got a bit of news for you. There's been quite a bit of a change since then. Yes, I've put a new engine on. Now, there's a bit of a... St oh, yep, and some new tyres. Now, the last upgrade was... Um, with the engine and the torque converter, uh, but with the correct gearing, with the, with the uh, jack shaft. So I'm, I've got to say that works really well. The um, the acceleration off the mark was just phenomenal. It just hit you in the back. It was great. You know, ten times better than it was with the uh, with the with the clutch, which is um, obviously my friend's go kart, but also ten times better than the wrong gear ratio. Um, the top end was very good. But actually, in addition to, to that, before I got out on the car to the last video, is I put on a performance exhaust. Um, well, I say performance, homemade, so it breathes a lot easier. Straight through pipe, basically. Um, and a performance air filter. You see the old engines here. Um, there's the uh, air filter there. And I drilled the jet out to, I think it's 0.25 mil. So... Um, to be honest with you, it was the smallest drill I had and it was bigger than the original jet and it was fine. It worked well. The spark plug was um, the right colour and it really did go. So top speed, it was it was flying. I couldn't tell you exactly what it was, but trust me, it was fast enough for the track. You know, you I went on a flat bit of ground and it was proper shifting. Um, when you're that close to the ground, it's probably, what, 25 mile an hour? <laughs> but it just feels really quick, especially when the steering's so twitchy. Um, so yeah, since then, um, a friend of mine uh, who has the go-kart, as I've referred to before, he, um, he bought... Uh, a 13 horsepower um what was it now 13 horsepower life and engine so naturally i had to go one up and buy a 15 horsepower <laughs> i mean it, ridiculous i know uh they're both exactly the same size physically to fit them in the car i fitted his his was a 390 cc and it fitted in he actually has a 30 series torque converter connected to that and i know if anybody knows anything about go-karts they're only rated to about eight horsepower so it's unlikely that that's going to last but we've actually been out for a ride and then so far it's lasted well um it's it's been a short ride it was just a blast up the up the track and back down um acceleration was even better than obviously my six power Tecumseh engine with the same torque converter um, but uh, the top end I don't think was quite there because it wasn't breathing it's a brand new engine don't forget as well so it probably wasn't running enough to actually get the RPM up um, it's obviously restricted with the standard exhaust and um, air filter so yeah the top end wasn't quite there at the end of the day the amount of power you got the gear ratio in the the rpm is going to limit your top speed uh we'll improve that in the future so my engine is actually a used engine but it's pretty much brand new it was just been running perfect um so it is a 420 cc and it's 15 horsepower so i uh was going to do the same thing with the um uh the torque converter but unfortunately um the shaft uh, from the engine was actually a uh, different size. So uh, that's a 26.4 mil, I think it is, or something like that, which is an um, inch shaft. And um, uh, mine original ones was um, three quarter inch. So um, yeah, I've, I had to, I just purchased a, a cheap clutch um, for now, just so I could go for a, a blast, because I could not find uh, the one piece for the torque converter, just so I could use my old torque converter, which uh, I have in the box here, somewhere, it's in there, there you go, um, to fit on, um, yeah, to fit on there. Now I know, like I said before, it probably wouldn't last five minutes, but you know, I was quite surprised the other one lasted, and it's not very heavy, this car, uh, and the gear ratio is so high, it, it, may, it may just survive, um, so, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's definitely better than the clutch. I've already had a go on this um, up my drive, and to be honest with you, uh, yeah, it's um, it's not gonna, it's gonna be annihilated off the mark. Um, compared, you know, with my friend's go kart, with uh, you know, two horsepower difference, but with a torque converter. Um, this has got fourteen tough um, uh, sprocket on here, so the gear ratio is uh, a lot higher um, for top speed. So once I get the bite, um, I'm gonna reel him in, but I just don't think the straight's long enough to actually get there. But it should be theoretical top speed of about. Uh, 35 mile an hour whereas his is going to be about 25 26 27 something like that so um yeah it's uh 
it's going to be fun. Um, he's actually got the original tyres. I've actually purchased. So I'm waiting to get out on this thing, so I just keep buying new things for it. Um, it's going to be a. It's going to be like some crazy 900 horsepower engine by the time I actually get to go out on it. But no, um, for now it's um, new tyres, new engine. Uh, it's on the clutch. I am waiting for a torque converter. I have ordered one. Um, it's actually it was just as cheap to buy a whole new torque converter, so I'll have some spare parts. Um, but it hasn't come yet. It's uh, Chinese, typical, taking the time. So um, when that's when that comes, I'll, I'll fit it. But hopefully we're going to go out for a ride this weekend and we will um, have a, a bit of a blast and I will film it. And um, hopefully this time I'm not get too excited and forget to film anything or to forget to press record on the camera. <laughs> so yeah, um, watch this space. See you later.